The Minister of Mines and Energy said with the leadership of Nampao to explain what had transpired after a transformer that is attached to a power line experienced a technical fault between Kokerboom and Aris on the 19th of November at 9 minutes past 11 p.m. The problem was really caused by a current uh, transformer that has blown up. Uh, as we speak, Nampower have uh, dispatched their technical people uh, to get, to get Mans Hope where that um, um, transformer is uh, to fix it as soon as possible. So at least we do have the, um, that line still supplying us uh, with the power we need. Um, now, just to, to say also that, you know, uh, the, the team is, is doing that. Uh, we hope that they will be able to restore that line um, today still. Uh, should that not be possible, uh, we can also assure the public that at least we do have some contingency where we can actually activate some of the supply source uh, such that we will not experience what we have experienced yesterday. These are all technical machines. Th machines do blow up. You know, things do fail. Uh, but I, I can understand that uh, we also need to understand what really caused the blow up. Uh, but as of now, we don't have that answer. And as I said, the team only went this morning. Uh, surely by the time uh, they restore that, they will also then also at the same time understand what happened to, to, to the transformer. Katima Mulilo remained the only northern town not to be affected as it is applied with electricity from Zambia. The managing director of Nampao confirmed that power has been restored to all towns that are supplied by its grid and no neighboring country was affected. The, the, the nation should feel uh, that everything is well under control. Our personnel has mentioned our on, on site. Uh, we have made necessary arrangements to make sure that the power should be, should be back online as it should be. This was actually a partial one, not the whole country. We have suffered at some point the whole grid that has collapsed and we managed to break it back and so on. To assure that uh, it will never happen again, I don't think that uh, one would really say it will never happen again. It's like somebody cannot really say my car will never break down again. I will, uh, you can't give that guarantee that my tire will not go flat in, in the entire life of my car anymore. It's the same thing. So, but uh, as for Nampawa, we will make sure to be responsible corporate citizens to make sure that uh, what we need to do is done and done correctly. Next week, Namibians will take to the polls. Today, one asked what are the chances of another power outage that might affect the election process. The minister said that this is not likely to happen, while the managing director advised the ECN to acquire generators for backup like hospitals. Reporting for Today, one, I'm Joseph Shefeni.